Have you ever thought about a world where AI might share your social media stories? What if creating your own AI companions became as easy as sending a text? Well, get ready. Because in the realm of Meta and Mark Zuckerberg's vision, that's precisely what's on the horizon. Mark Zuckerberg has set a bold new target, developing artificial general intelligence, or AGI, with Meta leading the charge. He envisions Meta eventually open sourcing this transformative technology, though the timeline remains uncertain. The AGI pursuit aligns with the broader industry trend of chasing superhuman godlike intelligence. Joining the AGI quest alongside OpenAI and Google's AI leader, Demis Hassabis, Zuckerberg expresses Meta's commitment. Despite lacking a precise definition or timeline for AGI, he's determined to push the boundaries. Notably, he's repositioning Meta's AI research group, FAIR, alongside the team crafting generative AI products across Meta's apps. The strategic move aims to swiftly channel Meta's AI breakthroughs to its vast user base numbering in the billions. In an exclusive interview, Zuckerberg emphasizes the necessity of building general intelligence to create the desired products. And he states, We've come to this view that, in order to build the products that we want to build, we need to build for general intelligence. This approach resonates with top researchers who are drawn to ambitious challenges. Meta's push for AGI reflects a commitment to advancing technology that goes beyond current boundaries, setting the stage for groundbreaking innovations. Zuckerberg is candid about the fierce battle for AI talent, acknowledging the industry's intense competition for a limited pool of researchers and engineers. With expertise in high demand, these professionals can command staggering compensation packages exceeding one million annually. CEOs, including Zuckerberg, find themselves personally involved in recruitment efforts to secure key talent and prevent researchers from joining competitors. Expressing the unique dynamics at play, Zuckerberg notes the aggressive talent wars with multiple companies pursuing the same profiles. The influx of venture capital into various AI projects adds to the complexity, making it easier for individuals to initiate external ventures. Beyond talent, computing power is a critical resource in the AI domain, particularly for training and running large models. Zuckerberg emphasizes Meta's readiness to dominate in this area, revealing plans to own over 340,000 of NVIDIA's H100 GPUs, the industry's preferred chip for building generative AI, by the end of the year. He proudly asserts Meta's unparalleled capacity, poised to exceed that of any other individual company, highlighting their commitment to scaling AI capabilities. Meta's ambitious strides in AI are underscored by staggering numbers. An estimated 150,000 H100 shipments in 2023, rivaled only by Microsoft and dwarfing competitors at least threefold. Looking ahead to 2024, Meta's arsenal will swell to nearly 600,000 GPUs, including NVIDIA, A100s, and other AI chips. Mark Zuckerberg proudly asserts that this capacity is unparalleled, positioning Meta on a scale that could surpass any other individual company in the AI realm an accomplishment he believes might be underestimated. Now, in a candid revelation, Zuckerberg sheds light on the elusive pursuit of artificial general intelligence, AGI. Even within the AI community, a clear and concise definition of AGI remains elusive, and Zuckerberg doesn't claim to offer a succinct one linear. Instead, he emphasizes the essence lies in the broad spectrum of intelligence, encompassing diversity capabilities such as reasoning and intuition. The question of whether AGI aligns with human-level intelligence surpasses it or transcends into a futuristic superintelligence becomes a quibbling point. Mark Zuckerberg envisions the path to artificial general intelligence, AGI, as a gradual journey rather than a sudden revelation. He casts doubt on the idea that a specific threshold will have a profound impact, emphasizing the evolving nature of AGI development. Meta's intensified focus on AGI stems from the release of Llama 2, their latest large language model. While the ability to generate code may not seem immediately applicable to Meta's apps, it contributes to the broader goal of building smarter AI. Zuckerberg reflects on the initial skepticism, suggesting that coding might not be a pressing need for platforms like WhatsApp. However, Meta went ahead and incorporated this feature, recognizing its structural importance in enhancing the language model's understanding of knowledge rigor, hierarchical structure, and overall logical intuition. The decision to aim for the state of the art and lead the industry in AI models is driven by Meta's ambitious spirit. Zuckerberg articulates this vision, stating, Our ambition is to build things that are at the state of the art, and eventually the leading models in the industry. Zuckerberg spills the beans, Meta's now schooling Llama 3. And brace yourself, it's not just any Llama, it's a coding guru Llama. 
Like Google's flashy new Gemini model, Llama 3 is gearing up with some nifty code generating skills. But hold on, there's more. They're on a mission to supercharge reasoning and planning prowess. Llama 2 is not exactly the rock star, but hey, it was the cool kid in the open source block. Zuckerberg proudly says, Llama 3 and beyond, we're shooting for the stars, state of the art and eventually the big kahunas in the industry. Now let's dive into the big juicy debate. Who's steering this AGI ship? Remember OpenAI's near meltdown? Yeah, it was wild. Zuckerberg, the puppet master at Meta, holds the ultimate power with his stock votes. It's like having the golden key to the kingdom, especially if AGI decides to drop by for a visit. So, what's his move? He flips the Meta playbook for Llama. Zuckerberg throws a curveball pondering the big challenge ahead. If you create something super valuable, it tends to get cozy in one spot. Concentrated like a really good smoothie. But hey, he's got a vision, the open source spectacle. Make things more open, he says, and voila. You tackle a bunch of problems, like making sure everyone gets a fair shot at opportunities and values. It's the open sesame of tech. He draws a sharp contrast between Meta's approach and open AIs, emphasizing the evolution of openness in the tech landscape. He reminisces about companies that once freely shared their work but shifted gears as they recognized the immense value of their creations, opting for a more guarded stance. Without mentioning names, he delves into the shift, pointing out the initial promises of openness by some companies that are now more reserved. According to him, there's a realization that certain advancements in AI are too valuable to be freely shared. It's a strategic pivot from the earlier sentiment of open collaboration. While safety benefits are championed by figures like Sam Altman, advocating for a closed approach in AI development, Zuckerberg sees a different angle, a savvy business move. He suggests that some of the major players advocating for stringent guardrails in AI development happen to be the ones with significant leads in the field. Although safety concerns are acknowledged, there's a subtle skepticism about how much this aligns with strategic business motives. In the ongoing dialogue about AI safety, Zuckerberg notes that the models deployed thus far haven't caused catastrophic damage. He weaves the narrative, highlighting that some of the largest companies, despite having early advantages, are the most vocal about regulating AI development. This observation sparks a hint of intrigue, legitimate safety concerns or a strategic alignment with their business goals. In his words, I'm sure some of them are legitimately concerned about safety, but it's a hell of a thing how much it lines up with the strategy. It leaves us pondering the intricate dance between safety, strategy, and the evolving landscape of AI development. Mark Zuckerberg's push for AI isn't just about technology, it's a strategic move shaping the future of Meta. Picture this. In the tech world, there's an all-out war for the best minds, and Zuckerberg, along with other CEOs, is on the front lines, wooing experts with eye-watering salary offers to secure the brightest talents. But it's not just brains that matter. In the realm of AI, having serious computing power is like having a superpower. Zuckerberg proudly shares that Meta is gearing up to own a whopping 340,000 of NVIDIA's H100 GPUs by the year's end. A real game changer in building next level AI. Why all this AI obsession? Well, imagine if your favorite social media platform not only connects you with friends, but also becomes smarter, more useful, and almost impossible to leave. That's the plan. Zuckerberg's Meta, already a giant in terms of users and profit, aims to use AI to make its platforms even more captivating. Now here's the juicy part. If Meta cracks the code and achieves artificial general intelligence, AGI, the decision to share it with the world or keep it under wraps rests with Zuckerberg. It's like he holds the keys to the AI kingdom, and he's not ready to reveal his hand just yet. But wait, isn't Meta all about the metaverse and those snazzy smart glasses? True, and Zuckerberg is quick to clarify, this AI venture isn't a pivot. Despite the recent focus on the metaverse and the successful launch of Ray-Ban smart glasses, AI is becoming a crucial player in Meta's grand scheme. It's not just a tech shift, it's an evolution, and Zuckerberg is adamant that the metaverse and reality labs are still very much at the forefront. He is laying it out plain and simple. Meta is all in on reality labs and the metaverse. Picture this, a world where AI not only crafts virtual realms, but also populates them with AI companions mingling with real folks. Hold on to your hat because according to Zuckerberg, a fresh platform is dropping this year, allowing everyone to whip up their own AI sidekicks and share them across Meta's social apps. And get this, he's tossing around the idea that these digital buddies might even start posting their own content on your Facebook, Instagram, and Threads feeds. Now let's not forget, Meta's not just any company. 
It's the big kahuna of social media worldwide. But here's the scoop. They're not stopping there. They're diving into the AGI game, aiming to build artificial general intelligence. Zuckerberg wraps it all up in a big mission, building the future of connection. So far, the connection has been the buzz of humans talking to humans. But here's the plot twist. Talking to Zuckerberg hints at a future where chatting it up with AIs becomes the new norm. He's gung-ho about it, whether the rest of us are on board or not. In the end, this isn't just about AI and chips. It's a tale of power, influence, and the evolving landscape of Meta's tech empire. Be prepared, because Zuckerberg's vision is shaping a future where AI isn't just a tool. It's the magic that makes everything Meta truly extraordinary. Remember to subscribe to our channel. If you found this content valuable, we'll see you in the next one.